Hey guys, welcome back. For those of you who are new here, my name is Melody. In today's video, my friend Candy's coming over and we're going to be decorating some gingerbread houses. Other than that, that's all I've got planned for this video. We'll just see where the day goes. All right, everyone, let's go. Right now, I'm just waiting for Candy to show up. I didn't purchase anything other than this tablecloth, which is too small for my table, and the gingerbread house house kits, along with a bag or two of Hershey's chocolate kisses. I have another bag that I opened with Hershey's kisses in here, and they are the Grinch version. Aren't those cute? And I am not wearing the wedding ring today because the last time, the last time we made gingerbread houses, what's a, I think it was about a couple years ago, we got icing everywhere. And when I say me, I mean candy. Okay, I got icing all over me, but you should have seen it. I wish I had a YouTube channel then because, oh my gosh, she had it like all over her hands. It was like watching like a child play with, with the icing. It was crazy. So uh, we'll see how today goes. <laughs> so this is pretty much all I did. I figured, you know, the kits come with everything. I didn't want to go too nuts because last time we got stuff everywhere. It was a mess. I did go ahead and throw a couple of chair covers on, on the chairs we'll be sitting in. And uh, that's it. That's pretty much it. So, so far, you guys, we've decided we like the Sam's Club house better because it is a little smaller, but you get, you get two different colors. You get red and white. And look at all these candies you get. Oh, look, you even get a little tube of green icing. Look, there's even got little gingerbread men. Do you see that candy? Yeah. You got two bags of those. And then look at red these, you guys. Green. Look at and that. Then color balls. Look. And then here is Costco. Okay, Costco does have a, a small green tube and a small red tube, but then you just get this one big thing of icing. And let me tell you something. I don't think this tube of icing is going to help with this. You do get a few more gingerbread men, but what I like about candies from Sam's is you get a tree and two gingerbread men. Oh, wait, a snowman and a Oh, they're snowmen. So you get two snowmen and then a gingerbread tree. And then back to Costco, you get the jellies. You get this, a little holly and the berries, and some peppermints. I, I'm, I think I prefer this set a lot better. <laughs> I still can't get over my poor house. The gingerbread ran away. <laughs> I'm getting out the hot glue gun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you might have to. I am. I
I'm looking at your icing and it looks good. Yeah, it's holding up good. All right, everyone, I'm popping in here because I think I got a bad batch. My icing is so runny and look at how good Candy's is. And you guys, yes, she's better than me, but this icing is so much better and Whatever. thicker. Where is it from? Do you see? Easy build ice. And then here's- Sweet, smooth, and velvety icing. And then here's my icing. It's so runny. <laughs> It's like a snowstorm. Costco, you did me dirty. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is the last house I buy from Costco. It's gonna be from Sam's from here on out. Well, I'll keep on keeping on trucking. I mean, I'm not the best at the decorating part, but it doesn't help that my icing is so. That was very sweet, whatever it is. Gosh, I don't even know what to do. It's so bad. All right, everyone. I hate to say this, but I've given up. It is so bad. <laughs> the icing is so bad. Hold on, let me show you. Bye. Okay. So here's the front. <laughs> Nothing is sticking to it. Now, I did, I did hot glue the, the thing. But, you know, I, that's when I thought it could be salvaged, you know, at least to make it, you know, look decent. But then look what happened over here. So the red icy that they gave me, it's okay. It's hard to squeeze out, but it's okay. Oh my goodness, I have icing all over me. But the, the green one, this is part of the reason why I have icing all over me. It's so runny, and I even did the squishing thing where you're supposed to squish it and mix it. Do you see that? It's super runny. It just pours out when you close when you tip it over. So I've officially tagged out and I'm just going to admire candies, which by the way is looking great. I do want to bring bring this to your attention though. Do you see how this gingerbread looks super pale? And then look at the coloring on this one. So much nicer, right? Do you guys see that? Then here's mine. And then there's candies. You can, you get a really good idea of it when you see it kind of side by side. And then so far, here's what candies got. Aren't those little gingerbreads cute? The little gummies, are there any more of those gummies candy that you got there? These are all I had for that. Um. It's actually been a few hours and Candy and I had a great time. She's actually gone home now. We had a blast, even though my house really turned out really bad. <laughs> However, that's fine. It, it was kind of expected because um, I'm not the best at decorating those. However, I did get some packages in today and I thought I'd unbox those with you. In the first box, I've got this phone, this phone accessory. I bought this so I could hopefully film a little better when I'm in my car. It's supposed to go in the car vent and had really good reviews. So I bought it during Black Friday. This next item, I bought it when I was worried about my Dyson, and I didn't think that we would be able to take it. And I did buy it during Black Friday, so I got it a lot cheaper than I would have paid normally. I switched the camera angle because I feel like the lighting's better this way. Oh. Mm. At least a little bit. That was Gidget going into the box. <laughs> And there she is, everybody. Gidget, are you having fun? 
You like it in there? Okay. It's the Tinico Pure One Air Pets. And I got it pretty inexpensive. And I thought that I thought that I would get this and try it out for you guys and uh, let you know how it works out. I'm not going to unbox it now, but I am going to do a special unboxing video, I think. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Okay, this next item is something my husband ordered for himself. I have no idea. Oh my gosh. I think I showed you guys the, that um, bead gun he bought, or wait, he didn't buy it, but he got it for free. You guys, look at what he picked up. I guess it's a Target drone, a Skyfire Target drone, and it says blast it down. <laughs> so, <laughs> this is something my husband bought. So, not a very exciting haul, I'm afraid. Well, my husband seems to think that I should unbox this for you now because he thinks it would be a good idea for um, Chris, a Christmas gift. So I'm gonna go ahead and unbox it and let you guys see it. I really have no idea what this thing does, but I think it flies and you shoot at it. So let's open it. Okay, so it's super tiny. That's my first thought and my other thought that's going through my head is that there's no way I'd be able to hit this. It's really no bigger than my hand. But then again, it's not made for someone like me. It's made for someone like my husband who loves stuff like this. And it looks like it's, you charge it with the USB or something, like a cord. Oh, here, it, it actually comes with a cord. So you do charge it and I see a phone here so I guess you oh okay it says here that it tracks stats as you blast it download the free app oh it has an optional manual control also okay apparently this thing has multiple multiple modes so it can fly on its own and then like if I'm by myself, I can have it fly and then I can kind of shoot at it. Or if I'm with a friend, the friend can control it while I shoot at it or I can control it while the friend shoots at it. So that's pretty neat. So my husband said he spent under $30 on it and he bought it at Amazon. I will leave a link for you just in case you are interested, but I'm telling you, that company that gave my husband that free gun, I forget what kind of gun it was. Honey, what's that gun called? Gel Blaster. Gel Blaster. That company that gave that to him for free, oh, they knew what they were doing because he is just gobbling, gobbling it up. Like he has just been buying accessory after accessory. And he, yes, I know this isn't by the same company, but still, they know what they're doing, don't they? It says it's Bluetooth connected and hit detection. So I don't know how this little thing knows, but I guess when you hit it, it's going to know. But I mean, for someone like me <laughs> to try to shoot a moving target, that's not going to be pretty. <laughs> you guys will have to let me know if you want to see me try to shoot this. Um, we do have a pretty big backyard. I just, I have a feeling the neighbors are going to think we're nuts. <laughs> Although they wouldn't be wrong. Well, I think that's going to be it for today's video. Thank you so much for stopping by. If you did enjoy this video, please consider subscribing. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.